I am back again and for today we are going to have an exciting lesson about math. So if you are ready, let's go! Today kids, we are going to continue learning about equal or not equal. So you have learned that when we say equal, this have the same number or have the same amount. So let's look at the activity on page 10 of your math book. So it says here, right in the box, okay? We have here the box, the numerals of items right in the circle okay this one is the circle the sign for equal so this is our equal sign or not equal okay this sign here correctly so this is an example so we have here foot rulers we have two sets this is set one and this is set two now we are going to count set one first so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. How many rulers do we have for set one? We have eight. So you have the number eight turn. Now let's move on to counting set two. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. So how many foot rulers do we have here for set two? Ten. So you are going to write the number ten inside the box. Now we are going to compare the numbers. Set A, okay, or the first set, we only have eight. And for the second set, we have ten. Now, do we have equal number of foot rulers? No, so not equal. Okay, the number of foot rulers or the numbers are not equal. So you are going to write now the not equal sign inside the circle. So this is our symbol for the night not equal. Another, ex another example is this one. So what do we have here? Okay, this is, I think, an eraser. Okay, we have and eraser so we have set a okay or set one if you prefer set one and we have set two so we will first start counting set one one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen so we have sixteen erasers for set one now, how about set two? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Wow! We also have sixteen erasers for set two. Now, let's compare the numbers. Set one is sixteen. Set two is also sixteen. Are they equal? Yes, so we have equal sets. So what symbol are we going to use? Of course, we are going to use the equal sign, okay, this one, and write it inside the circle. Now, are you ready? Okay, we will now try to answer the second set of pictures. Okay, we have here, okay, this one is, okay, I think glue, okay, glue. We have here two sets of glue, set one and set two. So here's what you are going to do. Count set one first, just like the one that we did for the foot ruler and the erasers. So we are now going to start counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen okay so how many glue 
okay bottles of glues we have here for set one okay how many have you counted 18 okay so what are you going to do write it on the box 18 okay next you also have to count set two so let's start counting one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen we also have 18 bottles of glue so write it on the backs provided now you are going to compare the numbers set one we have 18 set two we also have 18 are they equal yes they are equal so using our equal sign we are now going to write it inside the box okay there you go now for the paper clips do the same thing okay for set uh, set one count the number of paper clips write the number inside the box and for set two count the number of paper clips write it inside the box compare the numbers if they are equal write the equal sign here if they are not equal, write the night equal sign inside this box. Did you get it, kids? Well, good luck! The next activity that we are going to have, kids, is all about making things equal by adding. So you already have learned about equal and not equal. Now, how do we make things equal? We can make one way of making things equal is by adding. So I have, you have to take a look at the picture which I am going to show you. Okay, we have it here. How many penguins? Okay, we have picture of penguins. How many penguins do you see? So we have one, two, three. For set one, we have three penguins. How about set two? We only have two. Now how are we going to make them equal so that we can have the equal sign here we are going to add one more penguin okay so they are now equal so we have three and another three number two these are sea lions okay the sea lions just like the penguins are animals that lives in the cold places like the Arctic. So how many seals do we have here? We have one, two, three, four. For set one, we have four seals. How are we going to make them equal since we only have two seals here? Well, we can make them equal by adding how many more seals? Two. So we have to add one, two. Now we have equal number of seals. Set one, we have four. And for set two, we have another, another four seals. Now in your piece of paper, since you do not have your, uh, we are not going to use your book for this. In your piece of paper, you have to make the things equal by drawing three penguins on this side and three penguins on the other side of your paper. Okay, the same thing with the seals. In your piece of paper, you have to make draw four seals on the other side and on the other side of your paper you also have to draw four seals to make them equal. Okay, so that is what you are going to do and good luck! Kids, I hope that you learned something from our discussions and our activities. I hope to be doing fun with you again next time. Bye-bye!